Hi guys, it's Cami from Clonanow.com and I'm here at Sand Hill Winery to figure out what the coldest night of the year glow run is all about. So, hi guys, I'm with Lawrence who is the lead pastor at Metro Church. Can you tell me a little bit about what the event is today? Yeah, this is called Coldest Night of the Year. It's a national event. It takes place across the country in about 50 different locations. And we are the host for Kelowna. And uh, so it starts tonight at 5 p.m. and we'll have about three to 400 people walking, uh, some running, to raise awareness for homelessness in our city. And uh, we're very happy that Sand Hill Winery are kind of hosting our start and finish. And uh, Country 100.7 are kind of going to get us going and a bit of Zumba and all sorts of fun stuff to get people warmed up and it's going to be a great night. Awesome. So how many years has this been going on for? So uh, in the country this has been going on I think for about 12 years now. Um, we have been hosting it in Kelowna for the last two years so this is our second year and uh, yeah last year was a great event we wanted to make this year even better. So. Awesome and what does this mean for Kelowna? You know we have we have had a, a center for the homeless community on Water Street for about six, seven years now. Uh, it was demolished to make way for a hotel back in March, and uh, so there hasn't really been a daytime center for those who are vulnerable in our city to go to. But it's not just the vulnerable who are homeless, but there's plenty of people who are lonely, live by themselves. Lots of people just want to go to some, go to a place, kind of like Cheers, where everyone knows their name. And so, you know, we have a new place. Somebody donated a building for our use on the corner of St. Paul and Coronation. And we're excited that we're going to be retrofitting it, renovating it. And it's going to be a place where people can come and get coffee in a brilliant coffee shop and do art and hang out, learn skills and build community. Okay. So I'm here with Jody, and she's a Zumba instructor to warm everybody up for the event. Jody, can you tell me a little bit about um, what you do and what it means to you to be part of this? Well, I'm a Zumba and fitness instructor here in the community, and I believe that this is a very important cause. We have a lot of people who are very cold at night and don't have a place to sleep or a place to put their head down. And just even bringing awareness to that fact and, and raising funds to have more beds for people is vital for the health of our community overall. And that's why we're here volunteering our time today. So I'm with Carney, and she's a participant of the walk. Um, can you tell me about why you're doing it? Well, actually, it's very last minute. A friend of mine phoned me up today and said, would you like to do it? And it's a great reason to get out, exercise, and support the local community. Awesome. So what does it mean to you to participate in it? It's just giving back where you can in the little things each day. Well, there you have it. If you didn't know what the coldest night of the year glow run was all about, now you know. For clonanow.com, I'm Cami Hill.